My name is Paul and I'm originally from the UK, but right now I'm living in France. And more people probably know me as Nisha, but that's not actually my name, that's the name of my business, which is a company that produces high potency mushroom extracts and other natural health products for healing and performance enhancement. And I'm also a student and practitioner of traditional Tibetan medicine, which is an ancient yet highly sophisticated system of healing that is based upon the dynamic forces of nature. And so it's not only a healing art, it's also a way of understanding the structure and function of nature itself, how nature works, but also how the nature all around us, as well as the nature of the body and of the mind, at a primordial level, are all fundamentally the same thing. They're not actually separate at all. Over many years, I've actually sustained quite a lot of pretty serious injuries that resulted in multiple operations, and I'm still in the process of trying to heal some of those injuries. And this is really what led me to pick up the rope in the beginning, because it is obviously a low impact practice, but it's a non-linear practice. So the repetitions are not cyclical, they are helical. And this is precisely why the rope encourages the body to move more naturally. But more recently, I've been focusing on a different aspect to the spiraling patterns of the rope, in particular, the act of transitioning from one pattern to another, because I found that this can have an adaptive effect on the mind and the emotions, reducing repetitive thinking and destructive habitual tendencies and and so the rope can also influence the mind to move in a more subtle and natural way. And so this practice can very much be an active style of meditation. 